Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I will be teaching you how to crochet a ruffle top. If you're looking for a top that's perfect for spring or summer, this video is perfect for you. So I hope you watch and enjoy. Just like any crochet project, we'll start by doing a slip knot. Next, chain 12. Start our waistband by making a row of half double crochets. Skip the first stitch and make your half double crochet on the second stitch from the hook. This counts as your first half double crochet. Then make 10 more, making a total of 11. Next row, start by chaining 2. This counts as your first double crochet. Make 10 double crochets using only the back loops of the previous row. Doing this creates a ribbed effect. This makes our waistband stretchy which allows us to wear our top easier. Start the next row by chaining 1. This counts as our first half double crochet. Just like before, make 10 half double crochets using only the back loops of the previous row. Continue working on your rows, alternating between making rows of double crochets and rows of half double crochets until you reach your desired length. Just remember, you should only make your stitches on the back loops of the previous row. Once you have a length that can easily fit around your waist, connect the ends with a single crochet. Make sure your band is straight and not twisted. Now let's move on to the second part. We will begin this part by cleaning up the edge of our band. Begin by chaining 1. We will be using single crochets. You do have to make note which row you are working on. The rows of the waistband are now lying vertically. 
for the rows of the half double crochets, we need to make one single crochet. For the rows of the double crochet, we need to make two single crochets. Continue this all the way around. When you're done, close off your row with a slip stitch. Now, begin your next row by chaining 2. Make 1 double crochet on every single crochet from the previous row. Once you went all the way around, don't forget to finish your rows with a slip stitch. Always start new rows by chaining 2, then continue double crocheting all the way around. making rows of double crochet until you reach your desired length. Once you're done, close off that last row with a slip stitch. Pull your yarn and make a knot so that your stitches won't come undone. You can hide that remaining tail of yarn by weaving it into the previous rows using a threading needle. Part 2 is done! You can actually stop right here if you're happy with the tube top. But of course, this is a tutorial on how to make a ruffle top, so I'm also gonna teach you how to add the sleeves and ruffles. As you can see, I'm using my bra as a guide on where to place my straps. I also measured the length from the front to the back going around the sides. Once you know the length, 
Start by tying your yarn on the stitch where your place marker is. Start making the straps by making a chain. The chain should be as long as your measurements really. For me, I measured 13.5 inches. Attach your chain to your top using a slip stitch. Again, make sure your chain is not twisted when you attach it. I repeat the same thing on the other side. Start making the ruffles. Start your row by chaining two. On the next stitch, make an increase. This means making three double crochets in one stitch. On the next, make one double crochet. Continue alternating making three double crochets in one stitch and one double crochet all around. I already made a video on how to make ruffles, so if you want a step-by-step -step tutorial on this, you can check that out. It's just the exact same thing. Start by chaining two, then alternating between making three double crochets in one stitch and one double crochet in the next all the way around. Start by chaining two. Instead of making an increase of three double crochets, make two double crochets in one stitch, then one double crochet in the next. Continue alternating all the way around.
close off your row with a slip stitch and pull your yarn. Lock your end and weave the tail. All that's left to do is to clean the edge of our armhole and the top of our straps. To do this, make a row of single crochets. First armhole, once you're done, lock and weave the tail. Repeat the same thing on the other side. Done going around the second armhole. Instead of locking it, continue making single crochets to the front. This will secure your ruffles in place. single crochets on the front side, the back side, and both the sleeves. Once you're done with the row, 
Finish it off with a slip stitch and pull your yarn. Lock your work and weave the tail. And that's it, we are done. So that's how you make your very own crochet ruffle top. I hope you liked it! If you enjoyed this tutorial, I hope you like this video and subscribe to my channel. See you again soon! Bye!